<clears throat> What's up everybody, my name is James, I go by JSR, and it's Randall Race Hypo! Um, little bit of a Link to the Past randomizer race action for ya! Little action for you, Jackson, on this beautiful Sunday morning. Wherever you might be, it could be Sunday afternoon, or you might be, I don't know. Wherever it is, hopefully it's beautiful, because it's beautiful here in Vegas. A beautiful 115 degrees today, but I ain't worried about that. My house is nice and air-conditioned to a steamy 73. Today's going to be a good day. Um, I may or may not stream all the way through. Um, because there is some stuff going on today that I want to be a part of, specifically a certain randomizer tournament that I was participating in that ends potentially today, as the, uh, possible finals are today. I say possible because there is a match, and Crystal Saver versus Jam, in case you were wondering, Jam Eviler versus Crystal Saver in the randomizer finals, Crystal Saver is the defending champion. Um, he said he's willing to do two races today. So, whoever wins round one, if they do two, unless they lose round two, and basically if there's no round three, the finals will end today. So, it's gonna be hype. I'm pretty stoked for it. Uh, that is at... What time did they say that was gonna happen? I don't remember. I have to look it up after this race. But... The, uh, <clears throat> the race, I don't know exactly what... Oh, we have time, I guess. I guess we have time. I'll look it up real quick. You better not start without me. Come on. Alright, so 4 p.m. Eastern sets so at 1 p.m. So pretty much like right after this race, I'll have a little bit of time to do something else. Then I may cut stream for a little while. We'll see. We'll see how I'm feeling. Whoa, Chrome actually closed when I closed it? Anyways, uh... How many does this go up to? I think it goes up to 20. So yeah, um... That'll be really exciting, you guys. Uh, definitely watch that if you if you've been following the Zelda One randomizer tournament. The finals are going to be hype. That's today. Uh, Jam Evler and Crystal Saver, and I wish them both the best of luck. They're good friends of mine, and I, I wish them both to have a good race. I don't want anyone to lose on some BS like uh, not just how I got eliminated from the tournament, but in general, like. People don't want to see somebody lose because of a mishap. They want to see somebody lose because the other player beat them. Or they just weren't as fast as the other player, or whatever. So, that'll be really good, and I definitely encourage all of you to watch that. Um... I don't remember what channel that's going to be on. I want to say it's on, on, on Speed Gaming. I want to say it's on Speed Gaming. That's going to be dope. Um, after this race, depending on how long this race takes, because again, that starts at 1 my time, so it's in about 4 hours. If this race ends early enough, I may do a PB attempt of A uh, Link to the Past. And then, uh, of course, there is the uh, Link to the Past Weekly. Although I'm not really sure if I'm going to be a part of that today. Um, 
The uh, Zelda One Weekly will be this afternoon at 5. And um, I'm to second place again. I mean, that's pretty much the status quo for me. Uh, for those of you who haven't followed it as tightly as others. Sorry, I just there real quick before I lost it. Um, I am... <laughs> I have the misfortune of finishing second place in the weekly almost every week. And uh, I, I went on my stats just to look it up on uh, on Speed, Ra Speed Races Live. <clears throat> Pardon me. I went and looked up the stats just out of curiosity. I have one win and 11 second places in the weekly. And the one win was the week where I I'd PB'd in the race, but... Everybody else forfeit because they all had bad races, so it, it looks illegitimate. I was like, damn. Even though the people I beat were legit as fuck, I... <clears throat> Man, excuse me. So, I'm definitely trying to get that dub. I still want to win every race I'm in anyways, but... Um, I want that dub this week. I think it's... It's gonna be tough because Fappy is... Uh, extremely warmed up and in the zone right now, and then... Uh, Yunos is de-rusted his, uh, his Zelda 1, any percent no up A. And then, of course, the random effects, RC Drones, Fred Coughlin's, Jay Copers, those kind of people, Presticle. Well, they're going to be in the race, too, so it's not going to be a cakewalk. So, but I want that dub this week. I want it. It's something I've just, I got to get more wins. I can't, I can't keep getting second place, man. And it's not like second place out of two. It's like second place out of four or five or six or whatever. You know, it's just like I'm, I'm done with it. I want dubs. I'm getting me a dub this week. Anyways, I have been ready for almost ten minutes. We're still waiting on four people to ready up. And the race will begin. It's a medium-sized race. Uh, Act the Boker. Breasticle. G3RD0. I'm guessing that's Gordo? Gordo? I smoke Meth Daily 69, which I, that's the best name ever. Jim, yo boy, Newbie 404, Sonic Cam, and Spooty Biscuit. It will, uh, thank you for the good luck, sir. How you been, man? How you been, Hai? I always forget how to say your name. That's why I didn't say it when I first saw you. How you been, man? Is he? I mean, I'm not that good at this, so the odds are I'm not going to win anyways. I am going to be taking a few more risks today, though. Um, for example, I'm not going to the hobo unless I just so happen to be in the area. Um, I am not going to go to a pendant dungeon unless I have to. I, I, I've got to stop going to unnecessary places. Even though in, in yesterday's big weekly race, that ended up being a good thing I did. I still went to way too many unnecessary places. I finished 81st out of 106. That's pathetic. I mean, at least I wasn't last, but that's pathetic. I, I am a better racer than that. I'm better at this game than that. I should not be finishing that low. And uh, I didn't even have a bad run, per se. I, either they all had really good ones, or I just spent too much time doing unnecessary stuff so my goal in today's race and we've got another joined we were this close two people left already up and a new person joined the race so i might as well put my controller down um anyways that's one of my major goals in today's race this race i want to i want to eliminate as much of the uh of the bad stuff I don't want to get things unless I need them. Just checking my splits, making sure they're working. Okay. So eliminate a lot of the unnecessary stuff. It'll take a little luck. And let's not die in bad spots like I did in yesterday's race. Those three things. The second two are pretty obvious, but the first one is the one that I really have to actually focus on. Oh, I never turned on my... Let me hold on a second. There, now you should be able to see me. Yeah. 
<clears throat> so, still waiting on uh, two more people. Vodovic, who just joined the race, and it looks like Sonic Cam. I'm not sure if Sonic Cam's in or not. He's in the race, but I'm not sure if he's ready. But yeah, so things like the purple chest, the hobo, ice cave, or ice rock cave, I should say. Um, going out of my way to get bombos. Stuff like that. Sonic Cam is ready, we're just waiting on Vodovic, and then the race will start. It looks like he's about to ready up. He quit. Why'd he quit? Okay. <laughs> this seat is bootless till boots. Oh, they're gonna kick my ass, dude. I'm not good enough at this yet. I fully expect to finish mid-pack or worse. Um, my best finish in a rando race is five out of fifth out of sixteen in Zelda 3. I'm still not very good at the Zelda 3 rando. This is my fifth rando race. Um, but yeah, yesterday in the weekly I did really terribly. Hey, I'm Wolvie. How you doing? Thank you for the good luck. How you doing this fine Sunday afternoon? Bombs! Bombs! No, that is not a bomb! Early flippers. Well, that does mean I have some choices on where to go. Bombs! Bombs! Game, please. <clears throat> I want bombs, give me bombs. If I don't get bombs, then I'm gonna have to go back. Right, you got in my way, I'll kill you. I'll kill you. No, I didn't want arrows. Dance game. See, that's why I don't do that strat. That's never how I do that. I don't know why I did it just right there. Ah! Really hope I really would love a bomb drop just so I don't have to come back. No oh well. I'll take my one rupee. I'll take my one rupee and I'll like it. Yeah, no need to fake flipper, which is nice, but I really don't want to leave a room in this dungeon if I can help it. What? What? Hold on a second. What the hell is going on there? No! I don't care if I did the bitch way. I'm not gonna die into the freaking ball and chain trooper. The hell was that? That was just odd. I couldn't get my sword in it in his uh, hitbox for some reason. Come on, princess, and I'll never see again in this entire seed. Except for if I have to fight Agahim. I should have used Princess Zelda Sprite. That's what I should have done. Actually, Princess Zelda's Sprite in this game is pretty legit. Like, not so much right now, like what you're seeing right now, but when you play as her. Like, they did a really good job with her sprite.
Come on! Dance game. Oh well, I guess I'm gonna have to come back to the graveyard once I get the uh, boots or something. Unless I get lucky with the rat in the sewers. Did she? I also like the Chrono Trigger frog one. Glenn or whatever frog from Chrono Trigger. I, I think that's what it is. It's dope, whatever it is. I've never played this randomizer with another sprite. I've done the Zelda 1 randomizers with different sprites, but I don't like doing Zelda 1 with different sprites because it makes screen scrolling harder. Yes! Haha! -ha! Ow. Wow, this is all gonna get in my way, huh? Can y'all get out of my way? That would be nice. Every snake is getting in my way. So I lost a lot of time in this dungeon just farming bombs. But that's okay because I'll make that time up just on the principle that I don't have to come back, which is nice. Another bomb. Another bomb! That's good. Now we have bombs for Kakariko. Well, that was a bunch of shit. But that's okay. At least we know we got that. I'll take those. Why not? How embarrassing. See, I wasted 25 seconds just farming bombs and doing stupid stuff right there, but that's okay. Alright, let's go see if Agahim is required. Also, let's check our map. Only one crystal. Book and gloves required. So, we may end up going to dungeons with pendants anyways. around the dancing pickle oh leave me alone birds what's up dudes let's see are we killing the wizard today or no nope at least not unless I have to I've only got two bombs, so I'm gonna go... I'm getting it. Only because I'm here, I'm getting it. Besides, it's 20 rupees, 20 rupees helps. I'm gonna go down to that bottom left corner of Kakariko before I bomb all that stuff, just so I can get my bombs up. So far, a bunch of shit, but we're good still. I love that song in the woods. It's so great. So I'll do the uh, the thieves hideout first, just because there is a chance I could come across the bomb. I don't have enough for the. Uh, for the dude that sells the, uh... Ah, I thought that was a blue ruby. For the guy that sells the jar, the bottle. Nice. Not what I wanted. Nice. Nice. Okay, that was a good, uh, a good room. 
And then a single solitary arrow. Okay, so I've got to go down to the southwest area first. This is going to lose me time, but I don't really have a choice. I need bombs. Do one more trip in just to re-up my bombs and then we'll be off. Five rupees short. Four rupees short. I should get some money in this in this cave up here, so I should be okay. In the in the well. Holy moly! All the early swords. There we go. We're good on money. Got us a boomer. There's some bombs. And a magic mirror. Which boomer did I get? Red. Okay. Not quite go mode per se, but we're off to a good start. Damn. Lame, 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 lame. Let's let this chicken free. I always feel bad for that chicken. And then I blow up those ones, you know. Logic. Nice, we don't have three hearts anymore. That's always good to have. I only found three heart containers in the weekly yesterday. That was weird. That's right, run, bitch! Still don't have a bottle, which means I can't do sick, kid. Still don't have the hammer, so I can't do the magic cave. Let's see what our boots item is. And whether or not it's worth getting. Yes, it is. Alright, when we get boots, we got hammers, so we need the boots. Ooh, I don't want to jump off there. That was close. Probably should have just gone and checked to see what this was first. I don't know why I went and talked to him right there. I just felt compelled. I'll take it. It's not what I wanted, but I will definitely take it. All right, so yeah, save and quit. Let's go check out Moldrum Cave. I may have to uh, go to the hobo because my options are slim. I don't have enough for the the Zora yet. I do have Agaha, Agana. I could check. Let's just drain the swamp. I have the mirror, so that, that kind of makes this faster. But if this is the boots, though, getting the hammer opens up the dark world. I just need the the uh, moon pearl. So let's see what I get here. Maybe I'll get lucky, get boots. A uh, moon pearl would be nice. Or a lantern. My lantern. He did that. So now the question becomes, do I want to go to Ice Rod Cave now? 
seeing as how I have limited options. Wow. All that for a bomb. I want these bombs. It's worth it. Actually, I probably have enough bombs at this point. I could probably just stop collecting bombs at this point. Nice. We're almost enough to get to Zora. Hey, that's big. Hey, Yunos. How you doing, bud? Oh, God. No. I probably shouldn't be doing this. This is a big waste of time. I'm going to I'm going to go ahead and check it. Since I'm over here anyways, I don't have enough to go to Zora. And then I can go check the hobo, save and quit. And what do I do next? No boots means no hammer, which means... I guess I could go to Death Mountain now, even though that's not a, uh... That's not a crystal dungeon. Oh, I'm glad I checked Ice Rod Cave! Oh, baby! Now I can get the hammer. And since I have, now that I can get the hammer, I can go and actually go to Death Mountain. So I can get the old man, check that item, and, uh... Come on. I still need the book to do my crystal dungeon in the light world, but I don't necessarily need to do that right away. Oh, I didn't look at the island, son of a bitch. I totally forgot. Dan's game. I should just save and quit. Fuck. I, I should just I should just forget about it. But at least I'll know what it is. <laughs> It'll probably be okay, right? I'm just gonna go check. It's only about a 45 second time loss. And it's the silvers. I'm super glad I did! Okay, so let's go back to Kakariko, get the hammer. Good call, Yunos. I completely forgot about that, dude. We'll get the hammer and then I can go and check Magic Cave. So I'll do that. I still can check the old ladies. The the witch. So I'll check Magic Cave, then I'll go to the witches and give them the mushroom. I'll give him the mushroom. Oh yeah, oh my. Oh my. Then what else can I do before I go to Death Mountain? I think that's it. Oh, no, I got Kakariko Cave. I mean, uh... I've got the, uh, Sanctuary Cave. I can dash into that now. Let's do that first. Let's see, all I need, man, I'm, I'm already halfway to go. Of course, that, that's also probably the vast majority of the overworld items. I don't know how many actual overworld items there can be if there's a limit, but that's a good start. Yeah, so I'll go, I'll go to the, uh, 
mean, it does open up another item. The question is, do I go out of my way to get that right now? It's probably not a great idea to go and check that item right now. I really wish I had more rupees. In fact, depending on what I get right here, I may or may not just come back for Zora. Oh, I don't have a shield. <laughs> I was like, what? Why did that not block? Oh yeah, I don't have a shield. So I'll go to Death Mountain first. I'm gonna wait for Zora. So after I check her, I'm gonna go to Death Mountain. Hey, Sam Peelin. Let's go to Death Mountain right now. Let's not mess around. That's kind of what I'm thinking. I could hit the Quake Medallion, Zora, and, um... Ah, oh, with the Quick Turn! I need that. I'm going to Death Mountain. There's cabbages up there, at least from, from what I've heard. Oh, not much, man. Just chilling on this uh, gorgeous Saturday. Or Sunday. It feels like Saturday because this weekend's way too short. Go away! Just waiting for the uh, saver and jam race today. Yeah, dude. And I went there early. I was doing really well. But what ended up killing me, what ended up really dooming me was I couldn't find any of the medallions. Which ended up being in the Palace of Darkness, so I dug everything. Because I didn't want to go into the mire or the woods. So I dug everything in the overworld. Like, literally everything. I think I got every overworld chest except for the, the thieves chest. Ah, oh, you stupid freaking cactus. Or, not cactus. Everything's a cactus. Cabbage is what I meant to say. Oh, no! Stupid squirrel! Yeah, it was. Let's do this now. It's probably nothing. It's probably nothing worth it, but I'd rather get it out of the way. That was funny. Attaboy, we're playing Bonk's Adventure. Let's play. Here on uh, JSR's channel. Ooh, okay. It's better than what I usually find up here. Die, all you worms. All you worms. All the potion shops were in Death Mountain area. Aren't those the best? When you get to Death Mountain, you need, like, one more dungeon, and you're 90% sure that, like, level whatever you need is on Death Mountain, and it ends up being recorder blocked under Vanilla 7 or something. It's like, ah, oh, yeah, of all the freaking possible places. Alright. I can't do Spike Cave because I don't have the Moon Pearl, and I don't have anything to protect myself. With six heart containers, I wouldn't survive. So... We're gonna go into the tower, I guess. No, no, uh, what am I doing? What am I talking about? I'm not going into the tower. Dan's game. There is an easy chest there. Actually, it wouldn't be a bad idea because there's a bunch of easy chests on the first floor. Ooh, give me. What's up, Redbird? How you doing, dude? Thank you for the good luck, sir. Come on, baby. Give me something good. That's not what I meant. It's not good, game. Yeah, I'm, I'm planning on checking the island item just to see what it is. I'm kind of surprised I forgot to check the island item on Lake Hylia before I went in. That was foolish. What's up, Rob? How you doing, dude? You gonna get back on the horse, Redbird? You're getting way closer, dude. Alright, now we can do sick, kid. Wow, 
What? Wow, that was terrible. Hey! All right, we got a bottle, blue mail, and that was about it. Yes, sir. I kind of want to go buy a potion, but I need to save my rupees because I have enough for, uh... Oh, wait. Wrong cave. Hey, Johnny, thank you for the Happy Father's Day, although I am not a father. I do appreciate it. I'm not the daddy! You... What? What? Controller, please! I should have checked this before I came down here. Because that would have saved me this trip, but it's okay. I'm actually considering going back to the tower just to check it. Oh god, bees! I blame Jammy! Get off me, squirrel! Run! Let's never dash into that again. Let's just check these bottom floors real quick. These are two easy chests. Then I'm gonna up A. Maybe I'll get lucky and get the big key or the item or something. I don't think I can though. I think, yeah, oh, there's the big key. See, I know that I need the book. can't do that room anyways. See, I know I need the book. I don't have the bow, so I can't do uh, Eastern Palace. There is still a lot of overworld I could check, but I kind of feel like this is like the only spot in the game right now that I can really check. Besides Zora. So I probably shouldn't be doing this, but uh, to get into the Eastern Palace, it's, re it's a Crystal Palace. Flute Mitz Mirror. Oh, that would work too, yes. No, you're right. Uh, but I don't have the flute, though. Oh, dick. Well, there's a key to get back into there. I'm not even going to try a bomb jump. Not that I couldn't do it. It's just, I'm not going to do it. Do it the old-fashioned way. And then I might even just kill Mulder just for the hell of it. Let's just kill him. I'm already up here. It's only gonna take a second. So book or flute would work. I'm gonna have to come back in if he doesn't drop the item though. I think I'm gonna have to come back in anyways. I think the downstairs chest is gonna have an item. What the hell? I just did a Link's Awakening jump. That was awesome. Do I go back in? Do I go back in and check that last chest? Yes, because I'm here and I just want it over with. I mean, yesterday this was an important item, I think. Wasn't this a moon pearl yesterday? I really got to get better at item da uh, boomer da boomerang dashing. Yeah, I do need to go into the dark world. I still haven't been into the dark world other than just a few minutes ago. Get it and go. Alright, give me something good. Make this work my time game.
Let me think. Okay, so Death Mountain's done. Uh, shit. Need the flute or I need the the book. Yeah, that's where I'm heading. I don't think I have a choice, really. Ow! There's two items up here. I just saved and quit, so if the items are garbaggio, I can reset and get my rupees back. Uh, no, I haven't! No, I haven't! Dude, I completely forgot about that. Thank you. Alright, we'll go there after this. I completely forgot about, uh, Sam Ashton Rush around my mom, man. Whatever his name is. It's one of those. I'm sure I mispronounced it. Kappa. I just need the book. The book, the boots, and the motorcycle. The book, the flute. Or... I could, I, or the moon pearl. At least if I get the moon pearl, I can move on. Okay, so I'm not getting that. So I need the book, the the flute, or the moon pearl, and I can move on. I'm trying to think what else I haven't checked yet. Or the hook shot. I mean that's required, right? This game is a lot of fun to rando, to be honest. Does that open up Dark World for me at all? It does not. I still need the Moon Pearl to go into the Dark World. Although, if I could find a way into the Dark World, I could, uh... I could go pick up the Silver Arrows if I could find a way into the Dark World that would allow me to get back to the island. I just don't know if it's worth doing it right now. Probably not. That helps. That helps. Holy shit. All right, so we just got the book, that, and what did I get? Quake. Well, that just opened up desert. Let's go to the desert. That also opened up the dark world. And potentially is one of my two required pendants. So that's good. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Well, now I can do Hype Cave. So the question is, do I just go hit Ice... Let's hit Hype Cave real quick. Why not? Everything but Eastern. Which is nice, I guess. Eastern's kind of a long dungeon, so that's good. container and a cape. Useful, but not really useful. Ow! I guess I'll go pick up my silvers real quick. That means I'm gonna have to save and quit. I screwed up a little bit on my routing here. That's alright, we got it though. That's all that matters. I'm trying to get rid of the bow there. I didn't want the bow. There we go. So I'll go back to the Dark World, since I'm going over here anyways, I'll check the uh, Bombos item, since I have Master Sword and Book. Ha! <laughs> that was great. Let me think. Is there anything that I should do now, before I just go knock out the desert? I don't think there is, in particular. I've got everything I need to beat the desert. Thank you. 
That's a good one. Sweet. All the defense. And who needs a shield when you've got a red mail? That's the one thing that's really kicking my ass in this game in the rando is trying to figure out routing. Um, my routing is terrible. I'm just kind of like, ooh, there's a thing over here. I should go check it. Ooh, piece of candy. Okay, so that's useless. After I do this, I can get into the dark world. I've got Dark Town, Flute Boy. I can dig up the uh, light world version where the ocarina is. So doing the tower was a terrible decision. Because I didn't get nothing useful out of the tower. That, that's a, a shame. No, go away! Go away! That's good. Yeah, I've got a long way to go, man. I mean, this is my fifth Link to the Past race. This is gonna be nice and easy with the uh, Silver Arrow. Oh, I don't have a bow. Never mind. I was about to say this uh, Moldern fight's gonna be easy peasy with the with the silver arrows, but I don't have the bow, so I guess I can just throw arrows at him. No! Oh! Damn. Yeah, I haven't done very many. Um, it was intimidating. I don't know. Like, it was the same way Zelda 1 randomizer was when I first got into that. Like, it took me so long to get into it because it was just intimidating. I don't know. Zelda 2 randomizer still... Um, still really intimidates me. I've tried a couple and I just... I don't know. There's something about it that just makes me not want to do it. And I'd, I'd probably be able to get decently good at it. I just... I need to do it. I need to stop being a, a pussy and just do it. What? Oh, that's shenanigans and bureaucracy right there. Ah. Wow. What's up, Mark? How you doing, man? That's what happens when you bomb. What's up, LG? How you doing, man? Eh, Z1 can take a break every once in a while. Z1's a lot of fun, but this is just kind of... This whole rando is so much different than Z1. There is a lot of luck, but it's more about... Wow. Ah, should use bombs. Should just use bombs. Oh. 
Ah, oh, I actually got a heart container from a boss? <laughs> What's up, Slurpee? Alright, so to the dark world we go, folks. Let me think. Okay, so I don't have the Titan's Mitt yet, so I can't do King's Tomb. I do have the cape, so I could do Bumper Cave. I just don't think it's worth my time. <laughs> Blame Fred. Well, that's what I was going to say, is that this game is more about strategy of what items do I have versus where can I go. Where? Oh, crap. Whereas Zelda 1 is more like, which places am I going to be able to find items that are most likely, you know what I mean? Like, okay, I've got wooden sword, five hearts, and I'm in a whiz robe six. What do I do? Do I dig it or do I say, screw this, come back to it later and try to find another level or whatever? That's true. I could possibly, I could do King's Tomb from Dark World. I just don't know if I want to. I could hit Bumper Cave and King's Tomb. Hey, that's an option. Damn it. Come here, you. Hey! Well, that just opened up a couple things. Yeah, that too. Bomb management, rupee management. But there is something about the Link to the Past uh, randomizers that's just... I'll, I'll get the, this guy first. There's just something about these that are a lot more fun as far as... I guess it's because the combat's still very vanilla. I don't know. There's something about this that I really enjoy that I'm glad I started doing these. Like, don't get me wrong, Zelda 1 randomizers are a lot of fun too, but they can be frustrating. Alright, don't give me rupees this time, stupid dwarf. Go back to Mordor. I'm gonna go do Flute Boy. Nope. Let's see. Oh, I'm grabbing him. I'm here. Let's see. I still have Digging Game. I still have the other chest in, Kak or in uh, Village of Outcasts. So let's go do that chest first. At that point, I wasn't going to make a throw. I was probably going to miss it. Oh, whatever. Not a very good village. I mean, we did get the Titans mid. Ah! I missed it up. Let's go. Uh, yeah, the bat gave me something. I don't remember what he gave me. He gave me AIDS, Kappa. I'm kidding. He gave me rabies, yes, exactly. LG knows. <laughs> I 
I do have height. Did I already check height cave? I did check height cave. I do have Dark Death Mountain now. I could do that. I'll check the two items here. Then I guess I'll do Dark Death Mountain. I can think of worse things to get than a heart piece. Like rabies. Well, that's weird. He's already gone. I guess I could just do the village real quick. Just get that out of the way. Let's just knock the village out and be done with it. in here too. Hey, we finally got a shield. What's up, Matt? Steve's down. <laughs> ah! That's like that's my, that's my third bonk? Do I have three bonks or four? It's been it's been a pretty bonkless adventure so far. Ah, that was close. That's gotta be a glitch. I turn into a bunny there every time. is atrocious. The top four chests, you're talking about the ones in, uh, in Steve's town? No bug net, no fairies. But I do have powder, at least, so I can go for the god pixel. Oh, I thought I had it. Whatever, whatever, just get through. Okay. Ah! What the? That was just awkward. I have no idea, no idea how I even did that. I didn't even press A until after I'd taken that bop. That was just weird. Oh, Japanese version 1.0. How I love you. With all your quirks and your oddities. Oh, that was terrible. That's what I deserve. You should be ashamed of yourself, James. Get out of my way, little fairy sprite thingy. Or fire sprite. Whatever the heck it is. I haven't gotten an item, have I? But no, I got the shield. I think that's all I've gotten in here so far. Two items. What was the other item that I got in here? Oh, the arrows count as an item. How many items does Steve's Town does Steve's Town have? One left. Okay, so it's got to be blind then. It has to be blind. I mean, I got to kill blind anyway, so I'm gonna go ahead and take this bad boy out. Oh, 
What? What? Ah! Ah! Terrible fight. If I had had green tunic, I think I'd have died there. Dance game. I got you. So that rupee was my fourth item. Bo! Okay, let me think. Uh, Dark Death Mountain time. Let me think. What else do I have besides Dark Death Mountain? I've got Quake. What? Must have been too early. Cabbages, please! I've got Bumper Cave, King's Tomb, Dark Death Mountain. there's anything else what else is there there's got to be something else I'm forgetting I do have ether medallion I can get that while I'm up here I guess BBS All the hard containers. This is 100% rando run, folks. I have not done the pyramid. That's a good one, too. I completely forgot about that one, too. All right, let's go check the required pendant for Turtle Rock while I'm up here. Quake. We have Quake. So if Quake ends up being the Meyer pendant, then I am in good shape. Let me just check this real quick. container do I want it that bad probably not I mean it is a heart container it's only gonna take me a few minutes to get it or a few seconds to get it but I don't know if it not I'm not getting it I'm not gonna get it. It's too much time. Wow, there's my fourth bonk. I do have cape now, so I could do spike cave. I did get a B. It's a good B. Is that the good B that I got, or is that just a regular B? That's a good find. Now I can do Meyer. This is probably a waste of time. I'm going to save and quit after this. We'll go check King's Tomb. And bumper cave I do still need the cane I still need the fire rod wait damn it I went to the wrong place that's okay I can go activate my 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 ocarina at least That's what I'm thinking. Uh, so I've got three spots over there I can check on the way.
I can't do Ice Palace because I don't have Bombos or the Fire Rod. I can't do uh, Turtle Rock because I don't have the, the Cane. I can't do the Mire because I don't have the Cane. It's look and I can't do the Woods because I don't have the Fire Rod. So it's looking like Swamp's my next destination. There's a good chance that the Rods could be in one of those other dungeons. Wait, dummy. Hey, smart guy. You're supposed to go to the Dark World next. Yeah, you. I'm talking to you, the one holding the controller. Earthbound reference. I guess I could do the woods, but I wouldn't be able to finish them. Ah, there's my fifth bunk. If it says I've bonked more than five times, I think it's lying. You never played Earthbound? Oh man, it's a good game. If you're into RPGs. It's very, uh, very old school RPG, but with a different kind of feel to it. I like it. It's one of my favorite games on the Super Nintendo. Take that that's a helpful little thing yeah I think that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna go to the swamp next oops oh well I didn't want to go back into the dark world so yeah I'm gonna do swamp next what's up Buster chill oh you know it dude There is also the Pyramid Item and Quake, but I think Well, how do you get the catfish from there? You'd have to- oh, you can hook shots! I'll just have to go the long way. Oh, a bastard! This didn't steal my shield. Five and six, okay. You can swim across? What's on my shirt? Uh, it's a wooden sword with the caption, I took it. Dick, leave me alone, B. Fuck off! How you doing, Tank Tanks? I have, See, these are the things I'm kind of thinking, like, I shouldn't have done this yet. Because, like, in this situation, I'm getting- I'm going way out of my way for one item. Now, that item could end up being important, but what if it's not? And not to mention, I'm doing this a lot. This is one of the things I've got to stop doing in Rando. Like, how worth it is, is my time going all the way up here for one item? Come on. It was worth it! Oh man! That's good. That's good. Well, that just goes to show you sometimes your instincts can be wrong. 
I was, every bone in my body was telling me that was a bad decision. It ended up being a good one. A very good one. And we've almost checked out everything in the overworld. If I'm not mistaken, the only thing left is the stuff in Mire. Checkerboard Cave. Mimic Cave, which I can't do until I'm in Turtle Rock anyways. What else is there? I thought, for some reason, I thought I was already in the palace. Alright, I'm gonna get me a safety ferry real quick. What? Damn it! Stupid good bee. I do have the sick kid. I completely forgot about the sick kid. I do have sick kid and Kakariko still. I haven't done him yet. That's an easy one to check because it's right by a food spot. Knock the swamp out, then I'll go check Sick Kid. Then. I'm trying to think what else is there. There's the purple chest, but I don't want to do that unless I have to. There's something else I'm missing. Is that slower than normal? That felt slower for some reason. Six bonks. I don't need big key, but there's so many items in here, I kind of feel like I have to check everything. What? Stuck to the side. You see, that one filled up way faster. Look at that. Okay, so lesson learned. Don't ever swing your sword while the swamp is filling up. Because I think it slows the game down. kid or bug kid 
There's something else. I just named it. What else is there? There's the uh, pedestal. I don't know what the pedestal has, but I can check that when I'm in uh, Skull Woods, which I'm going to next. I do still need the can of Samaria. That's the one thing really holding me back from potential go mode. Pedestal can't have bow, is that a rule? Be oh yeah, it can't because uh, Eastern Palace, I'm guessing. That's what I'm guessing, I don't know if that's true or not. Wow, no! Come on, Argus. think what else there is uh yes chief you always have to get the crystals that's uh, required i believe what else is there there's mimic cave which is in turtle rock there's fat fairy which i need another i just wanted to check okay i thought i did that um there's fat fairy which I can't do until I beat the woods, which is where I'm headed next, although that's just by coincidence. I want to do the woods before I get the gold sword. That way the Mothi of the fight won't be a pain in the ass. Um, what else? I should just go this way. I don't know if you can get in this way, can you? Yes, you can. do this dungeon just like I normally do. Just like in a regular vanilla speed run.
No big key, so no point to go down there. Big key. This has to be a key. Or it's a piece of heart, so how do I get out of here now? Wait a second. Did I just soft lock the game? Yo! Look at this guy. I just soft locked the game, didn't I? How do I get out of here? Do I have to save and quit? We got one other way out. It's up here. That's crazy that they, the, the logic would do that. There's a chest in here too. Yep. All right, we're good. Let's go. That means the items have to be on the other half. Ah. That's a chest up there, if I'm not mistaken, but I think it's supposed to be a key. So what I'll do is I'll, uh... I'll beat this dungeon, and if I don't find both items in time, then what I'll do is, uh... Come back and check that spot I think has one more, um... That's Mirror Shield. Mirror Shield is the pen, the pedestal item. I already got the big chest. Horse shit. I needed that key, but I'm gonna go back and check that chest if this isn't an item. Oh. 
hate that fight. I hate that fight with all of my heart and soul. All right, we're gonna go check the other item. A lot of talk in the IRC about them being mad at themselves. It's a little bit of a spoiler because that makes me think that the bow is in an obvious spot. So I'm kind of not thrilled that it sounds like a spoiler, but I'm not going to say anything. I thought this was a chest here. What item did I miss? Can I really not save and quit right now? Is this, is this, a, is this real life? I just want to save and quit. The game won't let me. Um, the fuck? What door did I miss? I, mi I didn't miss any rooms. I swear I missed a chest. There it goes. Ice Palace it is, although I could go to the Mire. Right, let's do Mire first. No. Let's do Ice Palace first. I mean, I could technically go do Fat Fairy. So if this ends up being a waste of time, I could do Fat Fairy. Trying to think what else I have. Mimic Cave. I might do the the tower this palace legit because I still need items. So I might just do it legit and not worry about the bomb jump. The only thing that would stop me from doing it legit is if I got the bow in the cane. Trying to get magic, but whatever. Damn it! That was stupid. I've not been very good at that throw lately. Whatever. I did that all the way wrong. Yeah, I'm gonna do the, I'm gonna do the palace legit. Oh wait, damn it. I forgot, you have to hit the switch first before you can do that. I have a better shield. Get 
out of my way! What I wanted to see, though. Still don't have the big key, so this dungeon's not going great. I'm gonna burn a key. Just so I don't have to do any crazy shenanigans to get back. Actually, no, I'm not. I'm not burning a key. I will go the long way back. What? Oh man, that sucks. I thought that door opened up. Oh well, I just wasted a minute for no reason. Little things you learn as you do rando, huh? I swear this is a chest. Apparently not. This is a chest. Wow, wow, wow! The bow! Okay, do I keep going? That's the question. I'm doing this palace legit anyway, so I have no choice. I gotta keep going. There's a key in here somewhere. There's the key. There's a key in here somewhere. At least I thought there was. There it is. So that's a big find. I haven't done this palace legit in so long. There's the big key. Well, since we're doing this legit anyways, I'll go up. crystal switch at? I don't even remember where the crystal switch is on this dungeon. Oh, I know. I remember where I screwed up. I screwed up. This is why I hate doing this dungeon legit, because I don't remember where to go. I can't hit the switch, because I'm out of keys. Oh, this is bad. I think it might be faster for me just to mirror back and redo the palace. That's exactly what I'm going to do.
That's bad. Really bad. I missed a key somewhere. I don't have a key to get in that door. So I'm not even messing around. Let's just go. Just pull off the bomb jump and go. I'm glad I did the palace legit though, because I mean the bow was a required item that I couldn't find. Well, actually, I don't know if the bow is required. Because I don't have to do the palace. Now that I think about it, I don't know if bow is required in this seed. God damn it, James. You used to be so good at that. Oh my goodness. It's time for you to practice again, bro. Yeah, there, isn't there a key in there, though? I thought there was a key in there. Since I don't need to go in there because it's locked, getting that key would be a waste of time. I mean, at least I get the big chest item. If it's the Cane of Samaria, then this was totally worth it. So the only way to unlock that door... I don't know what I was just doing. Please be something worth it. A key. I just did all that for a key. Well, I couldn't get the. Uh... How do I get the crystal switch again? I don't remember how to finish this puzzle. Uh, the big key was. I think it was in the chest way up at the top on like the second floor where you have to go all the way around and pull the tongue. I just wasted a lot of time, but does that mean I'm in go mode? Am I in go mode? Maybe. Maybe. Let's go check the mire. I might be in go mode. Oh my god. Fucking genius. I might still check these two chests. They could have gold sword. I'm just gonna check them because they're right here. They're easy to get to. And look at that. Would you would you believe that that was what I needed? That's funny. Go mode means I don't need any more items to complete the game. I can go. I just have to worry about getting the crystals and beating Ganon now. 
So all I need to beat this dungeon is the big key. Any items would just be bonuses. Ah, oh, you dick! Still had a good room. So I still need a couple keys. Gold sword would be nice. So, probably, to be honest, the Tower of Hera is going to be my biggest flaw in this run. I shouldn't have done it. That was the biggest mistake I made in this run. I shouldn't have gone to the tower at all. I mean, would I have done it in that situation? Apparently, yes, but that's not a smart play. Yeah, basically. Where am I going? Basically, let's go. Let me get my hearts back up. Even though I have red mail, they're kind of low. Where are you? God, my menuing is so bad today. I need big key or I need a key. At least a key. I know where a couple chests are that I haven't gotten yet. So if this isn't the big key, then I'm gonna go and, uh... Well, I still need a small key too. I could just lower the crystal switch and get that key on top of the grating. Apparently I'm at 12 and didn't mark it. That's a locked door up there, I can't get to it. small key and I can go. There we go. The chest would be nice, but I'm not going for it. Let's get out of here. Wait, do I even need a small key? I don't, oh yeah, I do. I do. For this door. Wish I had beams right now, that would have been nice. Oh, this is not going good. 
Oh. Alright, good. I should be okay. That was not a good fight. Not a good fight at all. Just missed a gold split on that. That would have been nice. I gotta get better at doing spin speed without having to be on stairs. It'd make this a whole lot easier. Not a fairy. Don't dash into it. Damn it! I. All right, let's get in the cave. This is gonna be a disaster. I I was saying don't dash into it as I dashed into it. That's hilarious. Squirrels, please. squirrels, dude. They're so annoying. small key and a big key I think because I think the uh, chomp room is a guaranteed key if I'm not mistaken I might be mistaken there's the big key do I need anything else or just the small key I think all I need is the small key and I can go which of course means it's gonna be up here, but you know. So, go up and around and... And bang! small key. I don't know if that strats faster or not. It might be slower. I'm not sure. Well, smoke meth is done. First place. Time of 139.48. Which means it's time it's time to go or I'm gonna end up at last again. Fucking bots. Lava two room with two keys and big key. Okay. So I need one more key. Come here. So 
So there's a key right here I can get from this guy so I can immediately turn around and go back. Bingo, let's go. Pole's voice or something. All right, now we're super go mode. I don't even have to go down into the extra room, I don't think. Yeah. It's weird because, like, when you hit him with the spin attack in the right spot, it almost always. Yeah. Exactly. It's stupid. We were already good. Let's go. <laughs> Super go. <laughs> well, sub two hours is possible, but not getting last place is possible as well. So this is exciting. Wow! Oh my god, I'm glad I got a freaking magic potion. I don't even care. That was terrible. 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 Just terrible. Good fight, a good end of the fight, though. Lucky 13 on the heart pieces. Let's go. Oh, hey, Princess Zelda. I missed you for the five minutes you were in this game. Never mind. I don't even want to see you. I'm out. Bye. Alrighty. Big key, go! Gerdo is done. Second place time of 144.20. Still going is Act the Boker, Breasticle, Jam, myself, Newbie, Sonic Cam, and Spooty Biscuit. Early big key. Early big key. Bananas. Dance game. I'll take it, even though I don't think it's going to matter much. Always grab the things. Even if you don't need the things, grab them anyways. You don't know, I might find two more heart pieces in you. Probably not. That was probably very stupid, but whatever. Oh, there's one more. There's a key. Come on, big key. 
Ain't nobody got time to fight these guys. Just kill them. I got enough keys, let's burn it. Maps. Dan's game. Come on, big key, where are you? Shit. Okay, good. Where are you, buddy? Oh god. Mistakes were made! Ah. Did Sonic Hand finish? I don't even know if that's far enough. Is it? I always forget. Come on, Big Key. Wow. What a waste of space that room was. That's starting to scare me because these guys are still are really good racers and they're still going. They ain't. This must be the most obscure Big Key ever. <laughs> Probably should have gone to that room down at the bottom, but... Hey! Would you look at that? Picking up that heart piece ended up being a good idea. Nice. Alright, come on, baby. Silver arrow fight. That's an easy fight. Door lunk. Come on, baby. Damn it! I knew it was too good to be true. This is just a fairy fountain up here. I think I missed a chest somewhere. That's a useless room? Is this a useless room? I don't remember. It is a useless room. Shit. Just kill them all. Don't mess with it. This is the part of Ganon's Tower I don't remember. At all. God damn it. Wow. Wow. I'm not gonna make it. Whoa! chest there too.
Damn it. Ah! Stop it. Act the Boker and Sonic Cam have both finished. That means four out of nine are done. Hey, Crypto, or sorry, I misread your name. Kanjito, is that how you say it? I love this game, man. This is one of my favorite games of all time. In fact, I would go so far as to say it probably is my favorite game of all time. Whatever, just go. This is the Zelda randomizer, though, so this isn't the vanilla game that you remember. No, come back here. Stupid laser. Lasers. No! Don't make me have to do it. I will do it. I hate that damn room. That's the worst room in the gauntlet, the one with the blue guys. I don't know why it ate my input. Get me out of here! You better believe I'm getting this. Nope. Wow, newbie 404, fifth place. Come on! Stupid fireballs! Wow. Oh my god, I'm having a four cycle. Wow. Oh my god! <sighs> Eat a dick. Worst Lamela fight ever. Uh, this is a race, but yeah, I guess it's a speedrun. Um, the way rando races work... Wow. Oh my god, dude, what is going on with me right now? Four cycle. This is not how you win races, dude. The way these races work is that nobody knows where anything is when the game starts. All the items get shuffled. And, um... Spooty Biscuit, 6th place. Looks like another last place finish incoming for your boy. Looks like digging again. Uh, Tower of Hero is going to cost me a lot of spots here. You got to be kidding me. But basically, nobody knows where any of the items are. And we run the game like a vanilla game, but basically the object is to get all seven pendants as fast as possible. And not do that. hits with the tempered sword what
Yeah, I know. I know. Two. Oh, was it a poke? Three. Thank you. Um, sorry, I can't read your name right off the bat. What? Oh, I've had the wrong one. Two blue balls. Hey, boy. That was a good fight. Uh, Mackin x 81 Thank you, sir. How you doing today? There might have been two hits. Yeah, that seemed weird. Gem is seventh place time at 156.47. It's the only one still going are me and Breasticle. And apparently there's commentators. Is this being commentated? Are we being restreamed? I thought this was just a race. Stop being a troll, Ganon. Oh, I got you. Stop it, Ganon. Ooh, I thought I was gonna miss it. Wow! Whoa! Not a great Ganon fight so far. Ah, I could have had one more. Testicles done right when I'm done. I won't finish in last. Eighth place, time of 159.08. GG indeed. Thank you for the GGs, you guys. Johnny 1P, Loud Goat. The Real Sivard Zero, Galaplex, Redbird. Mackin X, Yunos. Yeah, I'm not last. Thank you, Andy, Andy. <sighs> I gotta get faster, man. I keep making bad decisions like digging Tower of Hera. I mean, that wouldn't have given me a win, but that was probably six or seven minutes on its own. Actually, that would have put me in right in the middle of the pack. Ish. No, no, I still would have been in like six or seven. But, I'm trying to think what else there is. I mean, I dug the Tower of Hera. It's got to be me going after all these single items. Although, if I hadn't gone to this, the Catfish, I wouldn't have gotten the uh, the Fire Rod. I think that was where the, the Fire Rod was. It was the Catfish item. And then, um, I mean, I don't know what else it could be. Is my combat that much worse? Is my movement that much worse? It's got to be routing, right? I mean, I'm no... I'm no Zelna, but my combat's not that bad. Not enough for 20 minutes of difference. It's gotta be all in routing. It's gotta be. Yeah, that's what I. It's gotta be. Thank you, M. Wolvie. Ugh, tickle Bean for sale. That was the. Uh, what was the Zora again? Was that the Ice Rod?
so I just gotta maybe watch some other people race more and uh, try to figure out the best way to do it. Hookshot, that's right, that's right. That's right, I remember now. Oh, shit, never stopped this guy. The all-important go timer. That's uh, that's important to stop on time. Did they check his slarshies? <laughs> Oh man, I mean it's still better than average for me, but I've uh, I definitely got to knock off about 15 minutes if I want to be competitive in this game. Um, it's helping me with vanilla. I mean it helped me. Uh, it's helping me with combat and stuff. I'm getting better at vanilla, but I'd like to be competitive in this game. The inaccurate go timer, Siv. You hate that timer, dude. You hate this tracker. What tracker do you use? Do you use a tracker? I mean, technically you don't need one for this game because the overworld, an overworld tracker would be nice. Because then you could maybe, like something like Z-Helper, but like every little spot on the map where you could check. I'd rather have something like that than, than an item tracker because I know what items I have for the most part. I mean, if you don't know what item you have, you just pause it and look. You don't use a tracker? So I don't know, maybe I could, uh... I wish I knew how to code. I'd make one. Thank you, Galaplex. The unknown shield sleeps again forever. So we were right about that. I'm gonna guess, uh, 15 bonks? True. True, the tracker is nice for the viewers, but an overworld tracker like Z-Helper would be really nice. Z-Helper on Zelda 1 helps tremendously in remembering what spots you've checked. I mean, the way I run my route in Zelda 1 Rando, it's kinda... I kinda already know where I'm going, but every once in a while, you'll find a uh, level and you won't go into it because you're you're underpowered and you'll come back to it later and you'll be like, oh crap, where was that six with the whiz robes that I didn't do five minutes into the race 45 minutes later? You know, well, hopefully not 45 minutes later, but that happens. Is there? Now that's something I would love to use. I mean, nothing against Zarby's tracker. I like Zarby's tracker, but I would love a, uh, a better tracker. But no, you don't need one for Zelda 1. It just helps tremendously, I think, because there are situations where... In, in, in A Link to the Past, I know I'm not doing Turtle Rock until I have both rods and the cane. More than likely, by the time I find both rods and the cane... Um, and the, yeah, yeah, I think that's all you need is just both rods in the cane, but by the time you find those, you usually have a better sword, more hearts, you're very unlikely... Oh, crap! Thank you, Yunos. Let me check this out. Let me peep this out. Um, like, more than likely, when you go into those harder levels, you're gonna have, um better weapons and more hearts and maybe the blue mail or something like that so it's a little different than zelda one where just want to make sure he wasn't live okay you know if i find level six whiz robes and i've got and it's not zero hp and i've got three heart containers and no sword or a wooden sword i'm probably not gonna go so that's definitely something different about this game and that's kind of cool it, it the thing I like the most about the Zelda Link to the Past randos is that you have some freedom in routing, but it's more or less understanding, okay, I can't go to the swamp without the hookshot, so I need the hookshot. So how much am I going to dig what's available to find the items I need to, to advance? That's different than Zelda 1, where you don't necessarily need anything other than what's required to beat the seed. You can beat it you can beat a seed without the ladder. If Ganon's not required, you don't even need the bow and the silvers. More than likely. I mean usually a seed does require those things, but this seed you know you're gonna have to get the rods. You know you need the cane. You know you need the bow and arrow. The hook shot, the hammer, the glove, the boots, cap them. Um actually I think you do need the boots. Nah, no you don't. I think I don't think you need the boots. It's just nice to have. But still, you know. Did I miss the bonks? Did I miss it? I think I missed the bonks, didn't I? Son of a gun. 
Well, I mean, the go timer is just there kind of for show. I really don't care about the go timer. It's just nice to know, uh, hey, I'm, I've been in go mode for 30 minutes. Ish. <laughs> there it is, 39 bonks. I didn't bonk 39 times, I call bullshit. Did I really bonk 39 times? True. You also need it if you, uh... What else do you need the boots for? Is that it? Just that? Or if the, uh, item on the bookshelf is needed, which in this case it was, it was the hammer. Oh, uh, really? Oh, GG, guys. That was fun. Let me see. BT's still not done yet. I guess, I guess I'll host bre uh, Breasticle. I'm probably going to take a short break. I'll be back in a little while. I'm going to eat some lunch, take care of some stuff. Um, I'll probably head over to the finals of the Zelda 1 Randomizer tournament, which will be at 1 o'clock my time, so in about an hour and a half. Uh, 4 o'clock Eastern. And uh, anybody in chat, correct me if I'm wrong, I believe it's at Speed Gaming. Uh, Jam Eviler versus Crystal Saber. Saber is the defending champion, so it should be a lot of fun to watch. I can't wait to watch it. Um, so definitely, especially if you like Zelda 1, make sure you guys check it out. It's, uh, it's going to be hype. It's going to be really cool. And depending on what happens, um, it could be over today. I think they're going to do two races tonight. So it'll be, uh, it'll be exciting, man. I'm stoked for it. Anyways, I'll be back later tonight for the Zelda 1 Weekly. Probably either a Zelda 1 Rando or I might, maybe, do my first runs of Mr. Gimmick. I've been practicing again. I'm, I think I'm close to ready. It'd be fun to kind of switch it up and run something different. But anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your weekend, a great rest of your Sunday, and I'll see you guys next time. Take care.